John Fraser here with the Keep Your Cup campaign for the month of May. I'm with my man Frankie D who's helped make this possible. And to all those who have kept the cup for the month of May, thank you because that's what made it happen. Now what we decided to do for this third and final video was go check the streets to talk to people about why they're keeping their cup, why they aren't keeping their cup, and what other people had to say about their thoughts on the campaign. Check it out. I'm here at JJ Bean at Commercial and Six, Sixth. I'm with my man Gabriel. He's a manager here. Uh, no. Uh, no, you're no, not a manager. No, 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 I'm not the manager. Okay. Yeah, I'm just a barista. Sorry, should I, should I go? No, should no, I'm no, taking no, off? no, please. <laughs> we, well, we want to talk to this guy, the guy right. who handles the coffee. That's me. Uh, how long have you been a barista for? I've been a barista for uh, a little bit more than three years now. Nice. The question I wanted to get at was, do you, through your years of experience, do you see an increase in using reusable mugs and using in-house mugs, or do you see that there's still this common problem of people throwing out um, reusable you know, mugs? I'd say that it's still a problem, people throwing out disposable mugs. But uh, I think that the idea of like you know bringing in like a reusable mug or like sitting down having a cup of coffee for here yeah. is definitely a growing culture yeah. in Vancouver. One of the strangest things is when people automatically assume that you're going to put it in a to-go cup. You know, I remember one time I had a customer ask me, like, you know, for an espresso in a to-go cup, and it's like, oh, are you sure you wouldn't like it for here? Mm -hmm. You know, like a little ceramic cup or something like that. And said, no, I like the to-go cup because it keeps it warmer longer. I'm thinking in my head, well, you know, how long do you want that espresso to sit there for? And do you know, is that true? Is, is it the paper cup keeps it warmer uh, longer? Or is that know, just a man. myth in people's heads? Or? I don't know. Like, uh... I think it's probably a myth in people's heads. Uh, you know, frankly, if they want something to stay warmer longer, I just recommend that they ask for it extra hot. There you go. You know? Yeah. Um, Solutions. So I'm here with my man... Callahan. Callahan. Hey, Pleasure to meet you. What's your name? Ty. Ty. Pleasure. Good to meet you, Ty. Uh, I just ran up to Callahan here because he is using a reusable mug in store, so we thought we'd pull him over and just talk to him about the Keep Your Cup campaign. Mm -hmm. um, how often do you drink coffee, would you say? On the regular. Daily? Yeah? Uh, close to daily. Okay. Once every two days at least. I like to come here. This is a very good place for atmosphere and creation. Yeah, I like the vibe that's yeah, going on the vibe. It's good people and it's too. fine coffee as well, so I normally try to get it for here and just sit myself down and Sweet. do some scribbling. Uh, how yeah. often do you, do you have a usable, reusable mug, kind of like this one here? Um, I do, in my back in uh, Montreal. I'm visiting oh, from there. Oh, welcome yeah, aboard. Yeah, yeah thanks. Maybe. Ooh, oh, also, I, I did bring like a reusable container with me <laughs> on my travels, but um, <laughs> Uh, I was in a place where I really needed to use the bathroom, yeah. and uh, it was full, so I, I turned my reusable uh, little container <laughs> into a, a, a urine keeper, okay. and then that took it out of the general circulation for me as like a, a viable drinking vessel. Okay. Okay. I still have it in it, my it, bag, as like, and I've used it. I've used it twice on this trip so far for peeing when I need to. <laughs> um, so like, you know. Uh, I don't even know if that's like doing my part for the environment or anything at all. Oh, well, you know, we're it would be better that. to run outside somewhere and yeah. like pee. <laughs> okay, okay, that's good. But you do say you're an advocate for. I'm an advocate. Cup. I'm for it. Oh, totally, totally. Oh, awesome. We're here to talk about people who are sitting in Starbucks with disposable mugs within the location. If you get a little zoom in behind me here, over my right shoulder, not trying to be a creep, there are two lovely ladies sitting down using disposable mugs while still in Starbucks. What are you doing? And these are the kind of things we need to address, is the awareness of keeping your cup. It's not so much about the cup, it's about something bigger than the cup. Oh shit! Liam, bro, what's going on, man? How's it going? It's going good, it's going good. This is, uh, speaking of keep your cup, this is a big ambassador for keep your cup. This is Liam, he's uh, from Moose Jaw. Uh, I don't actually know him, I just ran into him right now, he's a complete stranger. <laughs> um, he's been keeping his cup. Tell us a little bit about how you've been keeping your cup. I'm just buying into the campaign. I saw your first video and your second video, and Sweet. since then, for most of the month of May, I've been taking my cup everywhere, just trying to support. We had a pretty late night, took it all down Granville and through Yaletown, like, brings a lot of attention, easy to meet people, you know? How did uh, Starbucks react to you taking your, uh, get a shot of this too, look at this mug. How did they react to that? They actually were aware of the campaign, so really, they, yeah, they were really stoked on it. Glad I was being a part Sweet. of keep, keeping your cup. So, yeah, it was, it's all good. Hey, I'm here with Luke and uh, Mac, Mac and Luke. Uh, these gentlemen took their time out of their day to sit down with us and talk to them about keep your cup. 
Uh, I just want to answer a couple questions on, I guess, where's your guys' uh, reusable mugs? Guilty as charged. Guilty as charged. I don't carry one. You don't carry one? <laughs> what is it you like about these cups? Because I know a lot of people like the simplicity Con of it. Convenience. Simplicity, Convenience. Right? You throw it out, but uh, it does feel bad when you have to throw them out and waste all that. You know, so. <laughs> the, waste, the waste factor is, is, a, is a major one. <laughs> it wouldn't make sense for me to carry around a cup. Because you, uh, you don't drink enough coffee? Yeah, I mean, if I was, if I was drinking coffee every day, then yeah. But okay. only once in a while. Would you uh, start considering using mugs at Starbucks next time you're in? Maybe asking yeah. them for a... Uh... Yeah, if that was an option, yeah, I would, yeah, I would do that. Sweet. But if you ask, I'm pretty sure they have, they have mugs that you can use, ceramic mugs. No one will ask. Sweet. <laughs> we got it. We got two. We got two in. Well, um, you know, usually I don't do this. Well, actually, I do it a lot. Um, I walk through back alleys just to see what I can find. And that's not like, you know, you find some cool stuff in back alleys. I like have some great artwork pieces in the back alley. Anyways. I'm really, I'm really disturbed right now. Look at this. Look at this right now. Zoom in on that. Why are you guys doing this? Like, that's just weird. That's so weird to me. Oh, there's one more. There's one more here. Here we go. Oh, look at that. You imagine how many bins are full of cups. How many landfills? Where are they going? Maybe they're going to incinerator. Maybe they're getting burned. Maybe they're going after the environment, but they're going somewhere. Check it out though, guys. Like, what are we doing here? We're just wasting space. We're making garbage. We're creating waste. The shit don't go to an imaginary place, all right? So keep your cup, try your best, and let's consciously think about where our cups are going. Don't be that guy. That guy over there, sipping his own cup out of mugs. So try to keep your cup, because this isn't working for us anymore. This is not working. Biodegradable or not, they're only about 30% biodegradable anyway. So let's try to keep our cup, all right? Standing up for more than just a cup. I'm trying to. Uh, ah, throw down, throw down. Standing up for more than just a cup. I'm trying to throw down, not shut up. Mm mm mm. Got the next one. So catch the movement like it's a bad habit. Think twice about that cup before you go and grab it. Keep your cup.